I'm going straight in then. Go ahead. How are you? I'm Katie from Dubai One. Welcome to Abu Dhabi. How is it for you? Thank you. Thank you all for having us. Uh, it's been a blessing. It's been an honor. Uh, it's my very first time out here. So uh, experiencing new things. Uh, you guys all welcomed us with open arms and we're really appreciative. What are your new things you've experienced so far in Abu Dhabi? Well, I've never held an album before, <laughs> so that was great, or a falcon, so it was cool. First time riding a camel, it was awesome, and uh, we haven't really ventured out of our hotel as much, but it's been more so just uh, getting to know our surroundings a little bit, and uh, uh, staying at the hotel and being with our, our family and our friends, and, and uh, NBA and, uh, family, so... Uh, I'm, pr I'm pretty sure after the first game we'll be able to venture out a little bit more and uh, get to experience a lot more. So talking to you about these overseas games, and how do you actually prepare? Because even jet lag in itself, talk to us a bit more about that. Yeah, I think it's great that, uh, like I said first, I mean, it's an honor to be able to even, you know, come out here uh, overseas. Uh, NBA and basketball takes you to so many different uh, places and helps you experience new things. So greatly appreciative about that. But, uh, Definitely the jet lag uh, has been a struggle for a lot of us, but, um, you know, it's, it's the excitement, you yeah. know, that, that surpasses all of that, so uh, you kind of forget about it and get past it and you're just trying to get to the game just to get get there and, and give these fans a, a show. Well, we're looking forward to it. Last one from me. Talk to me about your pre-game ritual. I'm talking music. I'm talking food. Okay. I'm talking habits. Tell me everything. Okay, so uh, before, uh, the night before the game, I'll have like a chicken parmesan with angel air pasta. Uh, next day, probably two cups of coffee. Uh, uh, I'm a big Jay-Z fan, so I listen to a lot of Jay-Z uh, before the games. Uh, and then just normal routine, stretching, uh, lifting. Do you have any like habits, good luck things? Yes, so I'm I'm really OCD with like shoes being like turned upright. Everything needs to be in line. Can't have a dirty locker in my locker or the locker next to me. So if I see like someone's stuff all over the floor, I'll kind of like sort it out a little bit around. Just, just great energy, positive energy, I, I think really helps me out moving forward. And what can we expect from you this weekend? I guess, what are you expecting from the Abu Dhabi fans? Because we're so excited to have you here. Yeah, just um, one, being healthy. Two, uh, you know, giving the fans a show. You know, you know we, we, worked our, we worked very, very hard in off season to come here and, you know, be able to put on the show for you all. And uh, we want to do the best we can. Really appreciate it. Have a great week. Thank, Thank you. you. Uh, Thank Tim, you. before leaving for the trip, you guys have mentioned a lot about the value of team bonding and chemistry. It's early in the trip so far, but how has that gone uh, so far? It's been great. I think it all started, especially with us uh, getting together with the, with the guys in L.A. Um, back in August and, and just rounding the troops up a little bit here and there. Uh, just trying to build that team chemistry uh, and, and making sure that we know our goals moving forward. Um, so it all started off with that. Coming out here, um, it just builds that family bond. You know, you, you're out here and the only people you know, you know, for the longest are, are, is your group, is your team. Um, and the guys that you're gonna be going to war with and battle with uh, throughout the rest of the season. So um, this is definitely a, a great team building uh, atmosphere for us. Uh, we've been laughing, we've been joking around, we've been hanging out with one another and you see there's no clicks. Everybody's one click and, and, and that goes a long way. And I'm sure for the young players, like the rookies especially, has, do you find this uh, experience likely to be uh, especially helpful for them as they get adjusted to the NBA? Yeah, definitely helpful for them. Uh, Gives them an idea of how, as veterans, you know, prepare for games, of uh, the mindset going into a game. Uh, also, gives them uh, 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 the chance, you know, to experience the world, experience life outside of the states. Uh, a lot of these guys have never even been able to, you know, leave the country or had an opportunity to leave the country. And basketball takes you to places like this that are very magical and. And um, we, we greatly appreciate that. So uh, they're definitely taking it all in, soaking it all in, and, and they're happy to be here. Last question. Sorry, Stephanie. Hi, I'm Anissa from Papa Review. 